Many of you may be working from home during these past few months, and it could be impacting your mental health. Fox 24's in Kirika Azuka is live in Fayetteville. And in Kirika, how can we help prevent burnout? Hey, good morning, Tavares and Caitlin. So I spoke to a local counselor who says right now with everything that's going on, it's so important to make sure that our mental health is a priority. Andrew Cooper is with Stillwater Family Counseling, and he says there are three things that he suggests that we start doing today. First, come up with a routine. He says that right now with everything going on, it's easy to fall into kind of a relaxation mode, a vacation mode, and waiting until last minute to get things done. He says doing little things like taking a shower every day, fixing your hair, putting on makeup can actually help you be more productive. Now, along those same lines, the second thing he suggests is getting dressed every day. Now, it's easy to live in your pajamas now that we are home a lot more time, but he says that studies actually show that if you take the time to change out of your pajamas into even just a nice top, it can actually help you be more creative. And finally, make sure you are staying connected with the outside world. Many people are used to working in teams before this pandemic, but now, since we are more isolated, it's important to be intentional about reaching out to people that you work with. To be looking for opportunities to meet these needs because they're part of who we are. We need them to stay healthy. We took them for granted because they were, they, we were able to easily access them pre-COVID. Now we have to be much more intentional to meet those needs. Cooper went on to say it's not only co-workers you should be intentional about reaching out to, but loved ones and family members as well. Live in Fayetteville, in Kira Gazuka, Fox 24 News.